Well, of course, it's the same type of protest that you see everywhere. The bullhorns, the signs, the silly clothes. What is going to make your protest work? What's going to make it different? Is Obama listening to you? Why would he listen to you? He gets that kind of protest every stinking day almost. Your protest has to be different. Your protest has to send a message. What kind of message are you trying to send? That you're just going to scream like babies? No. You want a real protest. Something that's going to capture his attention. So that he begs you for mercy. Imagine this. Imagine instead of the signs and the bullhorns and the screaming, you put those down and you did a bank run. You all stood in front of the bank withdrawing your money. And if you don't have money, you just stand there or open up a small account. This would send shockwaves through his financial system. He would be afraid of that because you're threatening to bring it all down. This would give you the leverage you need. The leverage you need to win. Never mind this all type of protest. Think about something different, something new. Bank runs work. That's bank runs bring, bring down banks and that's what they're afraid of. You would have the leverage and the change you need and you don't have to waste your time waiting another four years before you can vote for a new president who maybe will do something different. You can force this president to do something now. Please go to my website at antiforeclosurearmy.com and look at the ideas there. There are ideas to help you gain leverage. You may not agree with everything that's said on there, but the strategy is what I want you to look at. So please, this is my website, antiforeclosurearmy.com. Thank you.